who encountered a would-be thief wearing this scream mask. Investigators say this was the man behind the mask and he followed his target from a bank. Phil Archer live in East Houston where the suspect was caught. Phil? Well, Halloween is close and in the spirit of the season, police say that suspect donned a fright mask to steal a bank bag and then lead them on a high-speed chase that ended here at this Burger King on the east side. It turns out he was already awaiting trial for his alleged involvement in a similar case last spring. Police say 24-year-old Damian Ross slipped on a Halloween mask before he burglarized a bank courier's car this morning outside of Spring Branch Bank. They say a bag full of valuable financial instruments allegedly taken from the courier's car was found in his car. Ross told us he didn't know anything about that. I don't know what's going on. I don't know what's happening. I don't know what's going on. I don't know nothing. Police say after the theft, Ross headed east on Interstate 10 at speeds over 90 miles an hour. That is until a state trooper saw him and tried to pull him over. That's when the chase started and ended minutes later after Ross hit a curb, disabling his car. Police say he then tried to flee on foot, but the trooper stopped him with a taser. Ross denies that too. I don't know what they told me. They ain't telling me nothing. I just know, I just know, loud men just grind they shooting people. And who won, who won run off? It turns out Ross was out on bond awaiting trial for a previous evading arrest bust. It was a remarkably similar case. He allegedly led police on a high-speed chase last March, crashed his car into a curb, and then ran into another Burger King restaurant, allegedly to hide, but customers pushed him back out the door. Ross wasn't wearing a mask that time, but it also wasn't his first trip to jail. So far, he's been arrested a total of six times for evading arrest. And today, along with those charges, he's been charged with carrying a phony ID and burglarizing a motor vehicle. Reporting live on the east side, I'm Phil Archer, KPRC Channel 2 News.